our Lone Star Girl wears a bikini with a twist. Miss Texas, Gretchen Paul Hemus. One more semifinalist, Miss Texas. There are three Nehemis, who's 23 years of age, from Fort Worth. She's a cattle broker and a spokesperson for the cattle industry. You are an urban cowgirl and a cattle broker. How'd you get to be a cattle broker? Well, you're not going to believe this. It's not actually anything I studied, and I really had no desire to do that, but I've always had a love for animals, and I've always been involved in the rodeos, and so I thought, at that time, I was doing real estate, and why not combine two investments for my my customers, and so I just read into it and studied it and started doing that. Now, this is, this is a semi-serious question. There are a lot of people these days who are afraid of eating red meat. Now, as a spokesman for the cattle industry, how do you answer that? Well, like anything, it's a choice. Um, if you choose to be a vegetarian, that's your choice. Um, there's nothing wrong with red meat if you just keep it to a minimum and if you just use your own judgment on it. And now, I'm, I'm summarizing this. Cattle broker, real estate license. You obviously are a good salesperson. I guess you could call me an entrepreneur. <laughs> what, what, what qualities does that uh, involve? A lot of curiosity and a lot of drive and a lot of determination and maybe a little bit of flexibility, too. Thank you so very much. Nice to have you with us. Will you join the other candidates? That's Miss Texas. All right, up next, here's Miss Texas. Gretchen Paul Hemus is 23 years old. She stands 5 feet 11 and a half inches tall. Her eyes are green and her hair is light brown. One of my proudest moments was when I was 18 and I earned my Texas real estate license. It was a goal that resulted from many hours of hard work, including a lot of math. And now I can face life's challenges with confidence and I can finally balance my checkbook. Next is Miss Pennsylvania. Miss Texas. This is Miss Pennsylvania. There are two names left in the five finalists, one of which is Miss Texas. The fifth and final name, Miss Texas, would you come over? Select the question. Let's see. We're going to uh, judge number four, Richard Anderson. Miss Texas, who do you think makes a better friend, a man or a woman, and why? <laughs> okay. To me, um, a better friend to me is a man, and the reason why I say that is because my brother is my best friend, and we have a lot of things in common, even though we aren't in the same sex, and uh, to me... The bond is, is there, and there is no jealousy, and it's just a closeness that is uncomparable. Thank you very much. <laughs> Miss Georgia, it's your turn. Texas, Gretchen Paul Hemus. She's a rodeo rider, cattle broker, real estate investor. She's wondering what is in store for her tonight. And finally, Miss Georgia, Michelle Nemeth. Ladies, do you want to come down here, please? Hang on to each other. I am about to reveal the name of our first runner-up and the new Miss USA. Now, should the new Miss USA be unable to complete her reign for any reason whatsoever? By the way, that could include being named Miss Universe in May. The first runner-up becomes Miss USA. Keep that in mind. Here we go. First runner-up is Miss Oklahoma, Miss USA, is Miss Texas, Gretchen Paul Hemus. <laughs> Congratulations.
to get a crown on this lady if we can. You are the new Miss USA. The cash awards and prizes are yours, as well as the chance to be our country's representative in Cancun, Mexico, at the 1989 Miss Universe pageant. Now, your predecessor, Courtney Gibbs, is going to read the Miss USA Creed as our entire cast serenade. The stage is yours. Gretchen, you are the new Miss USA 1989. Representing the state of the United States in the Miss USA project, in order to further the cause of peace and mutual understanding, dedicate ourselves to the idea of sportsmanship, friendship, and goodwill among all the people of the United States. Congratulations. Now, we've had a lot of Miss Texases become Miss USA. Are you happy? That's a dumb question, I know. Ecstatic is more like it. How about seize this moment? <laughs> Will you remember it for a long time? I thought I would never forget Miss Texas, but this is one up, I think. <laughs> Angie, we had our work cut out for ourselves. We went out to get a winner, and we got one. <laughs> oh, we sure did. A new star was crowned tonight, right here in Mobile, Alabama. She got up this morning, Gretchen Paul Hemus of Fort Worth, Texas, but she'll go to bed tonight as Miss USA 1989. And for all of our winners and the everyone. hundreds of people connected with the Miss USA pageant for Courtney Gibbs, for Laura Martinez Herring, Mindy Duncan, Angie Dickinson, Dick Clark, thanking you all for sharing this year's pageant with us. Until thank you. Until we meet again from Cancun, Mexico on May 23rd. Good night and Good night. congratulations. Good night. <laughs> Like it hot, and this winter Eastern has hot fares to the hottest destinations. Eastern, we've got your ticket to fun in the sun. This is Kathleen Sullivan. Tomorrow, Tom Landry's first television interview since leaving the Dallas Cowboys. Also, director Steven Spielberg tomorrow on CBS This Morning. Stay tuned for your local news coming up next.